Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. So I had a little piece of scrap plywood and I was thinking what to do with it and I thought I could make a uh, mobile phone, iPhone or smartphone stand with it um, just because there was only a small piece so I thought it would be ideal for that. So I went ahead and set up the fence on the, um, the table saw and then I cut down the uh, the useful parts So then I got my phone and I just roughly worked out the kind of size that I wanted. I then just needed to cut these pieces on the mitre saw. So I wanted the uh, the bottoms of these pieces to have angles, so they uh, they sat nice. So you'll see that in a moment. Um, I went for, uh, I think, around 30 degrees. And then you can see um, when it's together those angles will allow it to sit nice and flush on the floor. So now I just needed a little shelf which the, um, the smartphone would sit on. And I wanted to be able to still charge the the phone while it was on the stand, so um, I cut around a piece of scrap wood, and I then cut this out on the jigsaw, so that I would have a hole for the um, the USB charger to go through. So now I had all the main pieces um, assembled, I just needed to give it all a good sanding down. So um, I started off with some really coarse sandpaper and then I worked my way down to um, like a wet and dry in the end, a very fine paper.
So then it was time to assemble everything. And I wanted to get the, uh, the little shelf nice and straight. So there I'm using a scrap piece of wood. And I'm just making a line. So that I know where to drill the pilot holes. And for that I used a really small drill bit because I was actually going to use a nail. So I used two nails to attach the shelf and um, some wood glue. And I clamped it together so that I could then um, pile it into the shelf and then drive the nails in. So now it was time to get the back on, um, a little bit tricky, I just had to put it together and roughly work out where the pilot holes would go. I was going to use two screws for this and I drilled them straight in rather than at an angle. And I just finished off those um, holes with a, a countersink. Now I just squeezed those two pieces together to make sure everything was nice and, and compacted. And then I just put those two screws in and made sure it was nice and tight. gave it all a final sanding And then I finished it off with some boiled linseed oil. And when I'd applied that, I, uh, I wiped off the excess with some um, tissue paper. So that's it all complete and if you enjoyed the video 
please remember to give me a like and also comment or ask me a question if you have any and uh, if you're not already subscribed please consider subscribing for more videos so as always thank you for watching and I'll see you next time